Hi, Sam here with CAD Productivity. Welcome to Civil CAD Consultants Express Tip on traversing a slope at a specified grade. When creating roadways on steep slopes, grade restrictions for the vertical alignment oftentimes control where the horizontal is located. This is especially true if you're trying to traverse a slope with a minimum grade, such as down the side of a levee, into a borrow pit, or even up the side of a landfill that you're capping. There's a tool in En-ROADS that helps you find the most efficient location for that horizontal alignment. If I go to Tools, Application Add-ins, I'll scroll down and find the Generate Grade Contour add-in. Make sure it's toggled on. Then under Surface Utilities, I have a command called Generate Grade Contour. You tell it the surface that you want to traverse, the slope that you must maintain. Here I'm going to give it a 5% slope. A maximum distance. If you want to go all the way to the bottom or all the way to the top of the surface, then give it a large number. I'll try 1500 feet. And the direction is more of a starting point than an absolute. So I'm going to use my target button and tell it I want to start the traverse in this general direction. I'll turn on dynamics so that we can see it as it's being formed and then apply the command. As I move my cursor onto the surface you'll notice that it begins drawing an element showing me where a 5 percent longitudinal grade would traverse down to the bottom of my pit. When I find a location I like I left click with my mouse and it draws a three-dimensional microstation line string in that location. This line string of course can then be used to import a horizontal and vertical alignment. If I rotate the view around we'll be able to see that this is a three-dimensional line that has been created in my microstation file. This can be very handy to find the horizontal location of an alignment that follows a particular vertical grade. Thanks for watching. You can view more tips for microstation and inroads at civilcadconsultant.com.